how to attach a file to an email on the iPad. I'm going to show you different ways to get this achieved. At the end of this video, you will certainly be able to attach your files to your emails on the iPad. Let's dive right into it. First of all, we're going to open up Apple Mail here. So I'll simply tap on that. And after that, to write a new email, we're going to tap on this symbol here in the upper right corner of the screen. And then first of all, on our keyboard, we're going to enter the email address of the receiver of the message. Then I'm also going to add a short text. And now if I would like to attach a file to my email here on the iPad, then there are actually two ways to do it. Usually on the keyboard here in the upper right corner, you should see several small icons, one of which would be the attach file icon. However, this icon is actually missing for me here, and it might be missing for you as well. Here's how this icon should look like. So have a look on your keyboard whether you have this icon or not. If you do, it will look like this here. If you have that in the upper right of the keyboard, then simply tap on it and you will then be able to attach a file to your email. If you don't have that, there's luckily another way to get this done. And this is to actually double or triple tap in the message area here. And this should bring up a specific menu. So let us try that. A double tap was enough in this case. And in this menu, when you tap on this right arrow here, you might need to tap on it a couple of times. You will then actually see attach file here as well. And we can now tap on that to attach a file to our email. This will bring up the files app where you find all your files on the iPad. Typically, you will find your files here either in iCloud Drive, on my iPad or on downloads here. So from here, search for the file that you would like to attach. In my case, I'm just going to attach this zip file here. So I'll simply tap on that. And this file is now attached to our email. In some cases, it might seem that these attachments are directly inserted into the body of your message. However, I did a few tests and actually when I sent these emails with attachments to one of my other email addresses, I found that these files were properly attached to the email and they didn't show up in the body of the message because that's not what you want in most of the cases. However, if you want to be completely sure that everything works properly, there's also yet another way for you to attach a file to an email on the iPad, which I'm going to show you right now. To show you this other method, we first have to go back to the home screen of the iPad. Once we're there, we're going to open up the files app. The files app looks like this. If you can't find the files app, there's an easy way for you to bring it up and that is to swipe down with one finger from the middle of the screen here. This will actually bring up this search box here. And in my case, the files app now even shows up here as a suggestion. But if it doesn't, you can just type files on your keyboard. And you will then certainly find the files app here under top hit. So then just tap on that. And this time what we're going to do is we first search for the file that we would like to attach and then take it from there. So I'm going into my downloads here to find the file that I would like to attach. And this time, let's imagine that I would like to add this manboard.zip file. To do so, I will long tap on this file now, until I get to this menu here. And you can then go to share here and then tap on that. This will bring up this menu here, and you will then see mail here as one of the options. And we can use this here to attach this file directly to a new mail, which is pretty cool. So we will tap on mail. And as you can see, this opens up a completely new message, but this time our zip file here is already attached to our email. We can now just write our message and we're good to go. And then to send the email, we would simply tap here on this up arrow and we're all done. And this is how you attach files to emails on the iPad. If you would like to learn how to take screenshots on the iPad without the help of physical buttons, then make sure to watch the next video on my channel.